Crown Jewel is this Saturday, and here are our predictions. What is going on guys, Brett Alive back with another video. Today we have our Crown Jewel 2024 predictions. Who will walk out of this show as Crown Jewel Women's and Men's Champion? We're gonna be running that up in this video. I'm here with the Brett Alive Champion, Brother Dink. I'm actually happy to be here. I still can't believe he's the champ. If you guys missed the match, it is on the channel. You can go watch him cheat. But these are our Crown Jewel predictions. Skibbity Toilet Riz, living, uh, Rizzing Up Livy Dunn in Ohio. Bro Baby got Gronk and the Rizzler Riz Up the Double Chunk Chocolate Cookie. Pro gets the McFlurry before GTA 6. The women's Crown Jewel Championship. Same thing, you know, uh, you have the World Women's Champion going up against the Women's Champion. Smackdown versus Raw, kind of. Whoa. Nia Jax versus Liv Morgan. Dominic Mysterio's girlfriend Liv Morgan going up against Nia Jax. Obviously big size difference between these two superstars. <laughs> size difference. But uh, I don't think it'll be a big factor. Or will it though? I don't know. <gasps> Wait! Tiffany wait, wait. Stratton. There you go. He just said my prediction. Tiffany Stratton could possibly get involved in this. Because both champions are in the ring. Yeah, yeah. But who does she cash in on? Does Tiffany Nia Stratton Jax. come out cash in on Nia Jax after the match? Yeah. May okay. So how about Liv Morgan wins? Can we agree on that? Oh, we're she's gotta a flaunt that belt. Cause she's she she needs everything. She's been taking everything. We gotta Liv, agree on something. Liv Morgan's gonna take the dub. Okay. And Raquel's gonna get her out of the ring, leaving Nia Jax just lifeless L in yeah, the ring. Taken out, and then Tiffany Stratton. Tiffany Stratton's gonna come on out. Tiffany's gonna cash in. That on has show? to be. You think Tiffany's gonna cash in on oh, the yeah. show? Mm -hmm. Okay. Because they've been kind of fading her away with the Candice LeRae type thing. Yeah, with yeah, yeah. Okay, so we're gonna we could agree on Liv Morgan then. Yeah. Liv Morgan's gonna win the Crown Jewel Championship, and I don't have a Tiffany Stratton cash in on this. Our bonus, our bonus prediction yeah, 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 is yeah. Tiffany Stratton cashing in. Maybe, but uh, we both have Liv Morgan winning the Crown Jewel Championship. Seth Rollins and Bronson Reed have been begging for this match for the past couple Monday Night Raws ever since Seth Rollins returned. Curb stomp Bronson Reed's head into freaking steel stairs during Braun Strowman's match. Uh, this was this has been a great storyline my opinion i'm excited for it uh bronson reed or seth rollins who wins see this is another one of those matches so far with the first two they've been just 50 50 shots yes and i feel this is another one of those because i mean you're bringing seth rollins back after that injury took against bronson reed right but like oh man but bronson reed taking another loss like he did to braun Strowman. i know back right? to back but this one on a main card show yeah bronson reed losing again i don't know but he got the last one. laugh on monday night raw he did that Big super attitude adjustment out of the back of a semi truck trailer. Yeah, and, and I don't see Drew McIntyre or CM Punk coming back anytime soon. Nah. Just screw that. For <gasps> Seth, unless CM Punk does. Oh my god! CM Punk's gonna screw Seth Rollins. Seth Rollins. I just said the prediction. Bronson Reed is gonna win. Oh my With gosh. The CM Punk. Whoa, it's funny that you say CM Punk because my original prediction was going to be Bronson Reed. Wait, no. No, it was going to be Seth Rollins to win um, because Bronson Reed got the last laugh on Monday Night Raw. It is but Bronson CM Reed. Punk's going to return. He's going to screw, screw Seth, Seth Rollins. Rollins. And then... And that'll give Seth Rollins a new storyline. Yeah, and then that'll get uh, Seth Rollins away oh from Bronson Reed. Oh my god, we're, we're agreeing on another Yeah, prediction. I think so, yeah. We'll, we'll, so we're go both going with Bronson Reed to win. Bronson Reed to with win. With a CM Punk return. Triple H was very hesitant about giving Randy Orton this new match with this new Kevin Owens. Supposedly there's a new style of Kevin Owens that nobody's ever seen before. Yeah, the, the, look, of it, the look in his eyes is just scary, according to Triple H. But anyways, Randy Orton, he's the Viper. He's the 14-time world champion. He wanted this match. He's got it. Kevin Owens, Randy Orton, former friends, uh, former tag team partners in RKO. Um, this is this is another. Well, I don't really think this is a toss up, honestly. Really? Yeah. Three, two, one. Kevin, Kevin Owens. Owens. Yeah. 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 I got Kevin Owens as well. Why do you say that? Honestly, I have no clue. 
I mean, if they're hyping up this new style of Kevin Owens, I feel like it would be pretty pretty dirty of WWE to be like, oh yeah, this is new Kevin Owens, and he comes back and loses. No, if it's a new yeah, heel but, Kevin Owens, he needs to come out, he needs to dominate Randy Orton, he needs to destroy Randy yeah, Orton. He, he's going to be looking for title shots soon. Yeah, 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 yeah. He, yeah. he wants something. He, he wants Cody. He wants Cody Rhodes. I'll talk about another guy that could possibly screw over Cody Rhodes in the match. Kevin Owens, even though he has a match with Randy. Um, True. But I think we can both agree that he Kevin... Could. Yeah, it's possible, right? Wow. But I think we can both agree that Kevin wins this. Yeah, honestly, I have no reasoning for it, but I mean, I would just think Kevin Owens would win. Yeah, Man, same. these matches are tough. The, this is a tough card. Yeah. Not gonna lie, this is a really tough card to predict. Um, but that means it's gonna be a good show. But yeah, we're going, we're going, we're going with Kevin Owens. The Women's Tag Team Championships are up for grabs in a fatal four-way. Lash Legend, Jakar Jackson, Piper Niven, Chelsea Green, Damage Control, Eos Guy, and Kairi Sane. Uh, all in a match up against the current champs being Jay Cargill and Bianca Belair. Uh, ought to be a pretty solid fatal hmm. four-way tag team match. But uh, I see Jade and Bianca losing the titles. Honestly, I'm, I I hope so. Yeah. I, I, did, we need I them see them losing the belts. To be split up. We need them to be split up. Jade man. needs to turn heel. Yeah. Those are two great solo competitors that mm. are just being wasted as a tag team. Yeah. In my opinion. Who do you have winning? Well, I have, I have them losing. Part. Okay, so who's going to win? You got I Damage Control, guess... Piper Niven, Chelsea Green, and Jakar Jackson and uh, Lash Legend. Who wins? Oh, I have my prediction. Man. As much as I want to say Piper Niven and Chelsea, Chelsea Green. Oh, it's freaking possible. They could possibly win. Uh -huh. But if I had to guess, probably me last legend and I was gonna say chick. that. I was gonna freaking yeah, say that. Yeah. Okay. Because they're like newer. Yeah. But man, it's about time we need to see Jade Cargill and Bianca Belair split up. Yeah. I, I think I'm that's just wasted talent being together. I have Lash Legend and Jakar Jackson. Yeah. I do. I like, do. They've been they've been, been hyping them up over the past yeah. couple weeks out of nowhere. Like they just pop up from NXT. They're on the main shows. I'm like, oh my god. Like, um, this is awesome. I mean, they're, they're pretty solid competitors. They're going to win those tag team titles. And possibly Jade turns on Bianca. I hope so. Possibly, yeah. Mm -hmm. A match that I've been calling for months, dude. Carmelo Hayes, LA Knight, and Andrade for the United States Championship. Current champ being LA Knight, obviously. Mm. Um, this match, they just came out with a brand new United States Championship with LA Knight's custom strap. So I highly doubt that LA Knight's gonna lose that belt if they just came out with a new design championship. But it's possible. Uh, what are your thoughts? I got LA Knight retaining. It's gonna be a great match. But uh, yeah, LA Knight's gonna win. Because when LA Knight loses that belt, he is he's gonna be, I hate to say nothing, but he's just gonna be another guy on the roster. Seriously. Yeah, because what else does he have going for him? Exactly. Nothing. He can never go with the tag team partner. Who wins? Carmelo Hayes, Andrade. Do they take the belt? Do one of them take I the belt? I got. What do you have? Curious. This this is this is another toss up, kind of. Ah, Carmelo Hayes taking it. Whoa. <laughs> yeah. So, Whoa. Yeah. I, I I mean something's telling me Carmelo Hayes is gonna win. Okay. Interesting. Yeah. I like it. Cause dude, I, honestly, this LA Knight stuff, man. In my opinion, it's kind of getting kind of old. Old. Mm. In my opinion, I, 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 I'm not gonna lie. To say that. I might get a lot of diss in the comments. No, no. <laughs> but I I think Carmelo is gonna win. Yeah. Because I think he was screwed in that game seven. Yeah, multiple times. And I think just so is Andrade. Over the weeks of Andrade and him facing, I don't know. I think just think Carmelo Hayes is gonna win. Interesting. The number one overall pick. Yeah, if you know, or it was or something. There was some issues with that, but yeah, he was in like the first round. Yeah. Um, but I'm still going with LA Knight, but he is going with Carmelo Hayes. I like that. It is official. It is a six man tag team match with Roman Reigns' bloodline versus Solo's bloodline. So, who's gonna be in this match? It's gonna be Roman and the Usos versus, not Solo, I think it's gonna be Jacob Fatu, Tamatanga, and Tangaloa, the former tag team champions. Um, this is gonna be a great match, obviously. I'm really excited for it. But who comes out on top? Me, personally, I don't really see an ending to this. I see The Rock, right? I see The Rock. It's a bloodline match. There's always something that happens where it's like, okay, who actually won that? You know what I mean? I don't know. What do you think about Honest this? prediction, I do see an ending to this. Okay. That is a going pinfall? to be the the Timu bloodline. Winning? Yes. <gasps> oh but my gosh. this may come to a shocker, but hit me. I realized in the last Friday night SmackDown, we might see an interference from Sami Zayn. Oh my gosh. 
Sammy Zayn. That is the ultimate factor. He was Good talking call. about solo score. And it's and, Saudi and, Arabia. Yeah, it, it, dude, and, and we're going to wait to this see The guy. Rock. We're going to wait to see The Rock later on because, dude, he said the next time I come back, I'm going to go after Cody Rhodes. Mm, very interesting. Yes. Okay, yeah. that helped me out a little bit. Sammy Zayn, Sammy Zayn will get involved here, I think. Will he screw over so. Roman? I think he helps him. He helps him. I got... No, it might be a little too early for that. Maybe Sammy just makes his presence felt. Oh my god, this is such a toss-up. Another one! Another I, match! I'm gonna go with Roman Reigns and the Usos, because they don't want to oh, pin man. Jimmy, Jay, or Roman, I don't think, on a big no, stage that, like no, this. No, but that would kind of end the rivalry between those two teams, though. Not necessarily. Right? Uh, I'm going with Roman Reigns' bloodline. There's no way. Ah, uh, nah. Sammy I got the team move bloodline. Sami Zayn will be here, yep. guaranteed. Our final match, and some would say the most important match on the card, it is the Crown Jewel Championship on the Mets side of things. It's the World Heavyweight Champion Gunther going up against the WWE Undisputed Champion Cody Rhodes, who finished the story at Mania 40. Uh, this is a big match because this ultimately decides who the best champion is in wow. WWE. It's the top championships going at it. Gunther, Cody Rhodes, this is a toss-up. It really is. It truly I, is. <laughs> it could go either way. It's a flip of a coin here. Uh, I don't see anybody getting involved. Do you? I don't really. I don't see a. If it rock would be anyone, it would be a. It would be a Kevin Owens type thing. Oh, okay. Kevin Owens is possible. Or, or, or the, the Rock, rock of course, or because rock. he said, "If or, when I'd come back, I'm coming for you, Cody Rhodes." Yeah, yeah, not yeah. Not for Roman, not for. It's possible. That's possible. Mm -hmm. Um. But I'm going to just go out on a limb and say, because I had Liv Morgan winning, so I'm just going to go out on a limb and say Cody. So then we don't have two heel crown jewel champions. I'm going to go out on a limb and say Gunther's going to win. Oh, we're disagreeing on yeah. this one. Yeah. Okay. Because I really think they got a... Uh, I don't know. That's a toss-up. Uh, yeah, I don't know. Cody Rhodes has been getting a lot of hype over this class past couple... Or, I mean, past year. Yeah, oh yeah. And many oh, months. Have, trust me. And Years. I, yeah. And I think Gunther, to surpass the whole roster, uh -huh. would be giving him this crown jewel title. Gunther, wow. And I, th and I think and that really should be the needs. top guy. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, I'm still going with Cody Rhodes. He's going with Gunther. We agreed on most of the matches, but not all the matches. Not all. Let us know in the comment section down below what are your predictions for the show. I feel like this is a very unpredictable card. I feel like most mm -hmm. of Triple H's um, PLEs are very unpredictable, but not the last yeah. one. Not Bad Blood. I clean sweeped Bad Blood. I guessed every match correct. But let's, let's see if I, I do the same. Thing but I did predict jewel. WrestleMania 40 every single match. Correctly. Pretty much, besides the ladder match. No, not the ladder match, because I guess one of those teams. You guessed me. one of them, so but you got to get on my level. Absolutely, I, I guessed level. all of Bad Blood. Come I on. knocked out Bad Blood. I should get that championship. Nah. But anyways, that was Crown Jewel 2024 predictions, uh, and we will see you guys next time. But alive, I am not Elias. Day and one, this dude, out. Yeah.